Hello and welcome to a brief tutorial about how to use Coastal Eco Explorer. When you open the app, this is what the page will look like. It has two main buttons. The first is Explore the Park and the second says Learn the Ecosystems. If you tap Explore the Park, you will get to see this very typical looking map and you can navigate it pretty much like any map, like a Google map, for example. You can zoom, you can pan. Um, it's pretty much like any map that you have seen. Now, this is a map of the park and it shows all of the features that you can interact with on the app. The polygons represent ecosystems and the special points represent either flora, fauna, or special locations like the visitor center or the observation deck. We're gonna zoom in here to one of the ecosystems. And if you'd like to learn about, for example, this ecosystem, all you have to do is tap on the icon in the middle, tap the I button, and you'll be brought to the ecosystem homepage. You can read a brief intro, and you can click the learn button on the bottom left-hand corner to learn more about that ecosystem. There's information about the niche and habitat and the conservation of that ecosystem there. If you go back to that home page, you'll see a button for flora and a button for fauna. Typically, each of our ecosystems um, have three flora and three fauna featured. So here you'll see we have these three featured and you can tap them and learn more about them if you'd like. The same is true for the flora page. And finally, if you are ready to go back to the map or if you'd just like to see where the Pocosin is on the map, all you have to do is tap the visit button on the bottom right hand corner. This will not only bring you back to the home page of the map, but it will highlight or specify which of these polygons are Pocosin ecosystems, as you can see. It's pretty cool. All right, so I'm gonna go back now. I'm gonna use the back button on the top left hand corner. Use it again. Now we're back to the home page. So the last thing that you'll need to know, other than the fact that when you're walking, you can actually see your location on this map. Um, and so when you see your location, when you enter one of these polygons, for example, if you're walking on this trail and you're in this pink polygon, um, it the app will notify you to let you know that you're in that polygon and you won't have to go and search it and try to find out where you are because it will pop up and say, hey, you're in the Pocosin ecosystem, which is a really cool feature. But the other resource that we have for you on the app is on the top left hand corner the three bars if you tap that button you will see a way to navigate to pretty much any feature in the park that you'd like so if you tap the launch screen button obviously you'll get back to the launch screen if we hit that three bar button again you can tap on ecosystems and you'll get a full list of the ecosystems featured in the app you can search for the, the ecosystem that you like I'm searching Lily Pond here, but you can search pretty much anything you'd like. Um, the same is true, the same setup is true for the flora and fauna pages. So these are, this features all of the flora and all of the fauna that we feature in the app, and you can search for it conveniently. If you tap the all page, then you can search from everything. So that's the ecosystems, flora, fauna, and even these um, unique points like the bird watching area, for example. Now we're back to the homepage, and we hope that you enjoy exploring.